will contain both a cargo vehicle and a pastry, okay. which will give a range of 100 kg. There is a mix of a motorcycle and a scooter. So now you can comfortably keep your leg outside. Bharat Mobility Auto Expo 2025 offered a fascinating glimpse into the evolving landscape of two-wheelers EV mobility. While moving along in various stalls, we have seen many electric scooters which are showcased. However, we found an interesting concept of motorcycle scooter vehicle. So we have Mr. Prajwal representing Aventos. Let's hear something about this vehicle from him. From Aventos Energy. So Aventos is a company that's incorporated in Chennai. We are an electric two-wheeler manufacturer. Uh, we have been incorporated in 2019. Since then, okay. we have been doing an indigenous development of our electric two-wheeler. So our first maiden product is now ready. And that is what we have come here to the Bharat Mandapam for the okay. presentation at the Bharat Expo. So what are your future plans, you know, once you have the product ready, uh, and what are your future plans, you know? Uh, so we basically have a lineup of vehicles. Okay. What we see here is the maiden vehicle, which is uh, a, a scooter motorcycle hybrid combination. Okay. Uh, subsequently, we'll also be working on a motorcycle. So that mm -hmm. is the M125, All which right. is going to be a full-fledged motorcycle. And there's also going to be the S125, which is going to be uh, a more premium uh, scooter. Okay. So in the lineup, we'll also be offering a more advanced motorcycle, which will be an M150. So this will complete a lineup of electric two-wheelers, following which we will then venture into the three-wheeler space, right. which will contain both a cargo vehicle and a passenger. So you have a collaboration also with somebody or you know? No. Right now, we will plan to do an indigenous development in-house for all the components and all the vehicles. Okay. We are open to collaborations in future mm -hmm. based on how the technology or the business requirement is. And battery is also sourced by you or developed by you or it's a source? Um, at this point of time, we are sourcing batteries from outside, but okay. we have also begun development of our own batteries. Okay. So in the next six months time, once we have the production of the vehicle up and running, we will be using our own batteries and incorporating in the vehicle. Subsequently, all batteries that will be incorporating in the motorcycle, in the three wheelers, everything, will okay. be our own design and development and manufacturing. Okay. So this is our maiden vehicle. This is the S110, which okay. is uh, now RI certified. And this vehicle is the one that's gearing up for production right now. In the next six months, we will be starting the deliveries of the vehicle. Okay. So this vehicle has actually been designed as a multi-utility vehicle okay. for all use cases. So one of the main aspects of this vehicle is that you have a hybrid design. There is a mix of a motorcycle and a scooter. So you can see here, you have the big tires and the whole form factor as a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. So you will get the comfort, the rideability and access as a motorcycle. And at the same time, we have given this sort of a scooter kind through hole opening. Okay. So this will give you that scooter feel. So you get that convenience mm -hmm. of uh, different age groups, different kind of people accessing the vehicle. And okay. you also can use this as a storage space to put in uh, groceries or water cans based on whatever application you are at. You are using it for your personal use or for a business use and all. So and that's what where is the range should you get actually? Sorry? What range, range of the way? So um, the range of the vehicle will be, uh, so we are offering two battery options. Okay. Uh, one, we have a 2.4 kilowatt LFP battery, okay. which will give a range of 100 kilometers on the vehicle. And we also have a 3.2 kilowatt NMC battery, which is under development. So that will give a 130 kilometers of range on the okay. vehicle. Uh, so one unique aspect of the vehicle is that uh, we offer a removable battery. Okay. That's so you can see here, okay. uh, this battery will go in under the seat. So here you have a compartment which houses the battery pack. Okay. This battery can actually be removed mm -hmm. and you can replace it with another battery pack. So assume you are in one of these B2B business applications for fleets and all that stuff. You, are, you can avail more, more than one battery pack. So when one is charging, the other can be placed in and a vehicle can be used. Okay. In um, For consumer space wherein you are living in high-rise apartments and all that stuff, you need not worry about the hassle of charging. You can always just pick up the battery, take it to your apartment and charge it there. In case you do have the flexibility of charging ports in the parking location, we also provide a charging port in the vehicle itself. So okay. you can essentially just charge it like any conventional electric scooter. Okay. If you do not have the provision, you can remove the battery, take it up and charge it in your office or at home. So in addition to that, uh, because of the big tires and the mid-mount drive we have, mm -hmm. uh, there is a little bit sacrifice on the boot space. Okay. But we are providing sufficient boot space underneath okay. to put in the charger 
the documents and everything. All right. So whatever is essential for the rider, mm -hmm. he can always carry it with the vehicle. Okay. For the helmet, there will always be additional accessories that will come in. So you can probably have a clamp here to house the helmet. Uh, one other element that you can see in the vehicle is... That, our, this is also a space, right? This yeah, this is also a storage okay. space that people can put. One other element that you can look at is the chases. Okay. So the chases is a 42mm pipe which runs across the length of the vehicle. So you can see a photo of the chases. This chases is actually patented chases that we have okay. which will remain common for the scooter and the motorcycle. So through this patented chases, we are able to achieve a 2 lakh kilometer service life okay. for the vehicle. So which is a testimonial for the strength and endurance of the vehicle. So similar to the chases and everything, so all the components have been designed accordingly. So this is the grab handle which can withstand 200 kgs of weight. You can see a very strong dual suspension system. So it can handle so all the potholes and everything that's there on the road. And we also provide these kind of saddy guards, so which is been tested for 100 kilograms of loading weight. So of course it will help the women to house them, but also can be used for loading capability. Yeah. So one other thing that we are offering is, uh, so you have this vast opening like scooters, but we are also offering a footrest on the front. Mm -hmm. So for the typical user who is handling the vehicle, so if you look at a conventional scooter, the footrest placement is here, how you okay. carry it. But uh, when you're having actually load here or luggage, people kind of squabble on how they put their foot, correct, correct. like they do a wrong placement. So now you can comfortably keep your leg outside and you can have your arrangement. So for people who are comfortable with using a motorcycle, they will be used to this kind of a driving style when they have their legs out. For those who are using a scooter, they can have it close by. So yes. that is a convenience factor that people get. So the main aspect on the vehicle, why we are able to achieve a high efficiency. So we are actually offering a 20% more range. So that is actually in comparison to another EV which has the same battery, we'll be able to offer better range. So this is uh, attributed to our drivetrain. So in our drivetrain, we have a two-stage transmission, which is a first stage belt and a second stage chain. So chain drives is something that we have been used to and a lot of mass market vehicles, long enduring vehicles have been having the same thing. So we have incorporated the same thing. So this combination of belt and chain and our proprietary drive time transmission and gear ratio design, we have been able to achieve higher range and higher mileage on the vehicle. So that's what translates into a bigger range on the vehicle and a longer endurance in the vehicle. So we all know that chains are a very robust mechanism. So they will help give the longevity and contribute to this 2 lakh kilometer service life. Uh, with some minor maintenance here and there. So our vehicles will be powered with uh, our new batteries that we are in development. So these batteries have a proprietary Tejas design. So this design is able to enable us to provide you an 8, eight year or 1 lakh kilometer service warranty on the battery itself. So right now the battery which has, it does not have that, but this is under development. Yes, this is under development. So this okay. is a new battery pack that we are developing in-house. Okay. It's our own technology that we are bringing in. So through that, we'll be able to offer you this eight lakh, eight year or one lakh kilometer service life okay. warranty on the battery pack. Itself. So this will be seen in the subsequent models. So we'll have two variants of this battery pack. One will be a 2.4 kilowatt LFP battery pack. And another one will be a 3.2 kilowatt NMC battery pack. Yeah. Uh, while the LFP is attributed towards a longer life, a longer activity, the 2.4 will give you about 100 kilometers of range on this vehicle. So this one will be? So this, uh, a same enclosure will be used for both the batteries. Okay, both the batteries. So it's uh, a choice on the cells and the arrangement internally in the pack. Okay. So this one will get housed in the same battery compartment as you okay. see. So it is basically this, uh, the vehicle can accommodate both the batteries. In addition to what battery you see in the vehicle, the battery compartment will be able to accommodate both the battery packs as they have the same design coming. So in addition to the battery, we also have a vehicle control unit that you can see here. So this vehicle control unit acts as the brain of the entire vehicle. So the VCU communicates with all the components, the motor controller, the BMS, the uh, instrument cluster and everything. So there's a lot of intelligent algorithms that we have implemented in the VCU. So basically it takes data from the BMS on how the cells are, what voltages they are, what temperatures they are, and it communicates to the motor controller, regulating power, efficiency and everything. So overall, it is not just a simple vehicle, but it's a smart and intelligent vehicle which can act on what condition it is at. So all these elements together is what helps us contribute to this 8, lakh, eight year or 1 lakh kilometer warranty on the battery.
with the stalls like Aventos engineers sparking a conversation about design, technology and reliability. So we have the complete information about the EV. This looks promising for the Indian market. This has the capability to beat the popular 100cc ICE bikes in the market. Let's talk about the price. The price are mentioned on the screen. What do you think? Do write in the comment section below. Best part, it is indigenously developed. We are looking forward to drive one very soon. If you like the video, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon. We will see you in next video. Thank you so much.